Hey guys, hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Akusia Behini. If you're new, if you're a returning subscriber, hey boo, hey boo, what it do? Hello, hi, hello. <laughs> I love my returning subscribers. They're always here for me and I love you guys. Um, but in today's video, as per the title, I am finally okay i've been saying this for the longest time and i've been wanting to share with you guys for the longest time but i'm finally going to be sharing with you guys how i lost 60 pounds in a matter of two years and that's just realistically what happened okay it wasn't six months it wasn't nine months i'm about to slap somebody sorry about that so let me put out this disclaimer my i have a toddler i have an almost two year old toddler in the background playing watching cartoons and that's just my life so if you hear anything like that in the background it is just my child all right <laughs> now second disclaimer before i get into the video this is not a video of how i achieved a flat stomach <laughs> i just thought i should say that if that's why you're here no flat tummy what has been achieved so just if that's why you're here then please don't watch the video this is real result real progress and i just really wanted to share that with you guys so i wanted to say that it gets out of the way but yeah <laughs> so in today's video i'm gonna be sharing with you guys everything that i did to shed all of the baby weights that I gained when I had my second baby. So without further ado, I don't want to talk too much. Let's get right into the video so that I can share with you guys everything, all right? A little backstory if you don't know me um, I have two kids I have two toddlers one is five almost five and then I have one that is almost two now my first baby that business was already done I lost the weight went by really nice um, I think it also took two years for me to lose all of that weight and then I got back to 150 and I was very thin, I was very slim. Not like slim, I'm never really slim. No, let me just take that back. I'm never really slim, but I was like, you know, thick comes. Like I had, I still had my nice cute booty, but then I had lost majority of the weight or all of the baby weight. And I felt like myself again. Now fast forward to 2020, I, um, I mean 2021, I had my second baby. So in May 2021, I had my second baby. So with my first baby, again, that business went by. I did my intermittent fasting, you know, and I just want to say that intermittent fasting has been, has been literally the keen or the main factor of me losing every kind of weight with both kids. And that is, I guess that's my main thing to talk about in this video is literally intermittent fasting okay intermittent fasting it's is the best it is legit the best thing that has made me lose weight so much weight for two babies within like a very short period of time and i'll get to the reason why i'm saying that now second baby i came back from the hospital you know i was really eager to lose weight because i said to myself i did it with the first baby i feel like i can do it again it's a lie it's a joke jokes on me okay the strength that you have with baby number one you don't have it with baby number two and baby number two i didn't have the help okay all of that community the village that i had i had around me when i had my first baby i didn't have that because now i was living in a whole different country so it was just me my husband and my baby <laughs> me my husband and my baby so i took a break i did take a break for the first two months three months i think i went for a third um, month appointment and then i asked my doctor if it was okay to work out and then she was like yeah if you feel strong enough and i mean from looking at you i feel like you're good you know um so with that being said in my third month i started working out and 
you know I took it easy now with my second baby I think my approach was you know it's not a competition I don't want to put a timeline by it I am just going to go with the flow days that I'm tired I'm tired and that has legit been my momentum for the whole two years D literally my mindset has been like that for the whole two years days when i'm worn out because i'm a mom i have a nine to five job so days when i'm worn out and i cannot do it i don't do it okay and that's where intermittent fasting comes into play so intermittent fasting is basically if you don't know what it is i'm pretty sure you might know but just for those who don't know what intermittent fasting is intermittent fasting is just basically um fasting or not eating for a set period of time and then eating for a set period of time but the number of hours that you're not eating is way more than the number of hours that you're eating so what i would do was the 16 they have like different styles or different methods that people would do and what i was doing was a 16 by 8 which is very beginner friendly i'll try to link a few intermittent fasting videos down below so that they you know go in depth on what exactly intermittent fasting is but i was doing the 16 by 8 method which basically um meant that i was going to be fasting for 16 hours in a day and then eating eight hours out of that day so my um my way or my procedure that i would use is i'll skip breakfast because i find myself doing a lot of things in the morning in the morning i'm so busy and i go to work i leave home at 11 45 so that is perfect time for me to be able to eat right when i get to work or on my way to work so every time i'm always eating on my way or in the right to work and that was legit what i was doing now intermittent fasting is not something that i did like all throughout intermittent fasting is something that i would do on and off because i have time so i'm like i miss eating breakfast i just want to eat breakfast so i take a break and then i eat breakfast but what i can say is whenever i did intermittent fasting i realized that the results was way faster i would bend so much weight in a very short period of time than as supposed to when i was just working out and trying to be like working out and healthy eating and whatnot i'm not gonna lie i'm not the type i'm not the type with like the strength to be disciplined about food i struggle with like keeping you know discipline when it comes to food because i have a chunk of foods that i love that if i really 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 want to be healthy food wise um i would have to stop eating those foods so intermittent fasting was honestly the best option for me because i'm either starving myself or i'm eating <laughs> that was just it like i'm starving myself or i'm eating and i have come to a stage where i think i become more conscious about food um because i am the type of person who would cook more than i'll buy from outside so i think from that aspect it still makes my food a lot more like healthier or healthy ish if you would say that because i make it myself so i know exactly what is going into my food and majority of my foods are like african foods and whatnot so because i was doing intermittent fasting for the longest time what i would do is even when i'm not doing intermittent fasting i would not eat after eight because when i'm um on intermittent fasting i stop eating at eight so now even when i'm not fasting after eight i try as much as possible to not eat maybe just snack on a thing or two but not eat like a whole meal no I'm not going to do that after eight now I'm going to put some progress pictures and videos as I'm talking with date so that you guys will see exactly what I'm talking about but basically what had happened or what is happening is um, and I'm low-key kind of scared to share this video with you guys because my progress doesn't exactly look like social media progress and that's where all the disclaimers that I was giving in the beginning comes into play because social media really has giving a picture of what real progress looks like and that is not what my progress looks like but my progress is also real progress so loki i also just wanted to share this video with anybody out there who sort of has my progress but it's not seeing it on social media and feels like am i doing anything wrong no you're not doing anything wrong 
everybody's progress is different progress is measured differently when it comes to different people and different situations okay someone might have had just one kid and you might have had two kids or you might have had three kids so that is your belly expanding and closing three different times so now to the real statistics or to the real numbers when I had my baby I was 190 pounds okay 190 pounds i have never i'm only 190 when i'm pregnant i'm only 190 when i have a kid in my belly <laughs> okay with my first baby i was 190 as well and with this baby i was 190 so i wasn't so surprised it was kind of around the same weight now i am currently are you ready <laughs> i am currently 139 as of yesterday 139 so act in actual sense I've lost almost 60 pounds but it's insane okay it is insane and I'm saying that because I have never been 130 <laughs> like I've never been 130 like I've never been 130 <laughs> but I'm also very proud of myself because I put in the work okay i put in the work what did i do aside intermittent fasting i obviously was working out but i never went to the gym one day out of the two years i haven't been to the gym i haven't been to the gym in literally the whole two years so every single workout that you guys are seeing is all just at home workout now I would work out every morning that's that was literally my routine and is still my routine and I have three people on YouTube that I work out with and I'll link all of them down below I work out with the first person that I started working out with was mad fit um, amazing amazing YouTube workout she does only at home workout she was basically the main the first person that I started working out with because again she focuses on only at home workout I guess that's just to say that I went straight into strength training I didn't do weight loss and that was my mistake and let me just say that don't do strength training before you do weight loss because then I had to come back to doing weight loss I should have bent the fat I should have bent that whole fat and then gone into like focusing on making myself strong but I was just doing strength training and I wasted my whole time so low-key I wasted like a whole year just strength training and it was burning fat but it was so slow like it was so slow and I'll show you the progress pictures because from 2021 to 2022 I made literally no progress because when you look at the pictures because I was looking back at the photos and it didn't look like any different but that was the time that I was actually putting in so much workouts like I would wait um, sometimes wake up in the morning workouts and then workouts in the night before I go to bed and I wasn't seeing any real progress up until I decided that I was just gonna stick to doing intermittent fasting because also the reason why I didn't stick to doing intermittent fasting in the beginning was because intermittent fasting became tough because with the baby breastfeeding and sometimes you're tired and you just want to eat or munch on something so intermittent fasting was not an option for me in the beginning but after working out for a while I realized that I had to do fasting just to shed all of that weight because it was almost impossible seeing that progress with my workout and I'm the kind of person that I literally like to see progress okay I like to see progress in whatever I'm doing so I stopped doing focused exercises and then I moved over to working out with grow with Joe and then growing growing ananas I will put their names down below like they're these are just the three people that I work out with mad fit grow with Joe and then um, growing with Joe or grow with Joe and then growing ananas so these three babes they literally saved me <laughs> okay now growing with Joe mad fit was the first person 
going with Joe does a lot of cardio exercises but I love her energy I love her vibe and because there's always music in the background for you to like dance to she does she does like dance party workouts and now the reason why her workouts were amazing for me was I had days where my mood was just down I didn't feel like working out but then the discipline that's another thing that I have to talk about because actually building the discipline to work out or even fast stop yourself from eating at a set time or you know just even stop yourself from eating certain foods in general it's like a hard thing to do so that discipline building that discipline was also something for me but I guess I sort of had a bit of that discipline from baby number one and I'm just generally also a workout fanatic like I love working out I just love the whole idea of a strong woman and not just like mentally strong but also physically strong if you get what I mean so again I stopped doing you know strength focus um, trying to do heavy lifting and whatnot and then I just went to doing cardio and intermittent fasting intermittent fasting intermittent fasting intermittent fasting like I literally I'm the queen of intermittent fasting at this point like I can just do it for two days and then the next day I'm not doing it, and then the next day I bounce back but before it was so hard to do that because I didn't have you know the discipline and then you know just generally the mental capacity wasn't there but now I feel like because I've done it so much my body is just so used to going off of food for a while and then bouncing back into food and again intermittent fasting has been my saving grace so I am going to put two photos of what my body looked like and low-key again I am oh, literally doing this inside of me because I never thought that I'll be sharing these with you guys but I'm hoping that this video reaches the right person is what I can say I'm hoping that this video reaches the right person to let somebody out there know that real progress looks like this as well okay this is me when I had the baby and then this is me now 130 my stomach is not flat okay I've lost a ton of weight I obviously look very different in both photos but also I'm very proud of myself that every step along the way I keep going and I've told myself like I have told myself it's not a competition with nobody it's not a competition I need, if it's a competition it's a competition with myself okay and I'm grateful to even have the kind of partner that I have because my husband doesn't even think about stuff like that he cannot be bothered like he would you know some men would literally tease you with you know body shame you in a very funny way but then I mean in a, like jokingly but then think that it's just funny and I've been in those situationships before and I'm grateful that I landed with this person in marriage because he would literally encourage you you know he would tell you that you look okay you know like that's just the kind of energy that you want around you you don't want people who make you feel um, a certain type of way about your own self and the thing is you didn't you didn't do anything you had kids you you just had kids and then this is what you're going through so it's not like you you did something or you you know it's your fault it's like you had a child and I would not take that back for anything in the world okay but again I would not stop working out I would not stop taking care of myself and that's what I'm saying I would not stop taking care of myself and that includes working out and I know that working out would just make me lose more weight but I promise myself, the reason I'm also doing this video is I promise myself that when I get to my goal weight, I would definitely do a video, whatever I look like, okay, whatever my body looks like, I would do a video and share with people because right now I'm at my own weight, my own natural body weight without baby fat, nothing. Always my body weight has been around 150, 155, but now I am all the way down to 139 and again I'm proud of myself because I did that but then I also really want to share with somebody out there that if this is what your progress looks like it is progress okay pat yourself on the shoulder or like you know give yourself a hug you know because you did that you did that 
and the one thing that I have come to realize is that the loose skin because right now what I actually have the most is loose skin okay I have a ton of loose skin that I don't know how that is gonna go away that is also another thing that's I'm literally like so scared about like I don't know I don't know how that that loose skin is gonna go away and I'm hoping that with time it will shrink by itself because honestly for right now I'm not bothered like it's not even something that I'm thinking about right now I'm happy to actually see progress because in the beginning I wasn't and I was a little I was I was about to be mad because I was working out every day and like sacrificing my time every day to be in my little gym and I wasn't seeing anything so intermittent fasting definitely pushed me forward so the main thing again that I have done all throughout this time is intermittent fasting also working out alongside intermittent fasting has also been something that i've been doing okay so that has helped me with my strength i guess that's it i guess that is it this is my current again this is like what i currently look like and this is this is what i looked like before and this is what i currently look like and you guys obviously see what that looks like it's not like i'm saying it's not exactly flat stomach what you see on instagram but it's crazy progress is all i want to say i just want to say that it's crazy progress and i'm proud of myself because i did that i did that and i just want to say that so shout outs to you if your progress looks like mine as well okay shout out to you okay you have a team out there because i'm sure there's a whole lot of us out there who look just like i look right now but yeah <laughs> That's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. I'm hoping that I haven't forgotten anything that I wanted to say in this video because really and truly I was so excited to do this video that I just sat down and started talking. I didn't write anything down, okay? Everything that I said is just from my hair. So if it's all over the place, forgive me because it's really just from my mind and how my mind is looking like right now. So comment below if you have any questions. The sun is going down, so it's kind of giving golden hour or golden bronze or whatever, but we like that, okay? We're here for it. But comment below if you have any questions, um, anything that you wanna say and be nice about it, all right? Because again, this is just me sharing my very personal progress with you guys so i hope that you guys like it and i hope that this video reaches the right person and the right audience and just the right person who's looking for something like this you know the person who just really wanted to see what is going on okay and needed to know that you're not alone i need you to know that you're not alone so thank you guys so much for watching this video i'm gonna go away um subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done that follow me on instagram at akusia behini on tiktok as at akusia behini as well pretty much everywhere that you want to find me my name is the same and yeah i'll see you guys in my next video bye <laughs> bye guys